Again, I'd encourage you to close your eyes, get comfortable, relax, set your thinking on Jesus, on the Father. It may help to start focusing on your breathing and slowing down. Just breathe in slowly, deeply, hold it and then breathe out. And as you do so, focus on breathing in the breath of God, the love of God. And as you breathe out, you have more capacity to breathe in again. So breathe in and breathe out. Receive God's unconditional love. Let the Father love on you. Let him show you how much he loves you. Come to that place of rest and be still. Now, people often say, how do I feel God's love? That's individual for everyone. You may feel right now comforted. You may feel warm. You may feel a sensation. You just may feel God's presence. God may tell you he loves you. God may affirm you as his child. Love is different for each of us, but it's something God wants you to know by experience. So just rest and let him speak to you, touch you, affirm you, bless you. choice. You can make a choice and in making a choice, figuratively, you can step out of the boat. You can step into the ocean of unconditional love. You can sink and trust God to bless you, to heal you, to restore you, make you whole but you make that choice and you show by that choice what you choose to do whether it's getting out of the boat whether it's picturing a door and opening it whatever it is you just make that decision you're going to choose to surrender so that you can experience something more of God's unconditional love.
you're in a safe place. I believe the Father wants to meet you face to face. Father wants to engage with you, hug you, embrace you, show you how much he loves you. So you can receive that life. So you can breathe easily again. You can be refreshed with his presence. So I encourage you just to think of a door open up the desire of your heart to engage with God face to face as you let those thoughts of a door form in your imagination as you picture that door that door is in your spirit choose to open the door you're inviting the presence of Father, Son and Spirit to come in and fill you. You can choose to open that door and in opening the door, invite the Father in that he might hug you, embrace you, touch your life, bring wholeness to you, speak to you, reveal himself to you, tell you how much he loves you. And as he embraces you, as you're heart to heart with him, you may hear some of the vast, some of the thoughts he has about you that can restore you and bring you into wholeness. father's embrace be open for the father to take you onto the dance floor or into the garden to dance with you to entwine with you to bring you revelation and mystery perhaps the father would want to take you to the judgment seat to open the scroll of your life to purify, refine your life as a son, removing all guilt, shame, condemnation. If you're carrying any of those negative emotions, feelings, thoughts, just let the Father's love, mercy and grace wash it all away cleanse you in the fire of his love purify your heart if you know of anything just hand it over to him let it go let the fire purify it this is love he loves you he desires you to prosper and to succeed. 
he has plans for your life for you to be fully you Just go wherever the Father leads you. Feel free to stay in that place of intimacy. Don't rush if you feel you want to stay there. If you're in the middle of something, feel free to embrace that. If you enjoy these videos, would you please take a moment to like, comment and subscribe? It really does help. Thank you very much.